Morning, welcome to Coffee, Coffee with Grandpa. Today we're going to be discussing the Great Equalizer. Martin Luther King Jr. in the 1960s did his I Had a Dream speech. I have a dream. My poor little children will one day live in a nation where they will not be judged by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. I have a dream. I have a dream that one day down in Alabama with its vicious races, with its governor having his lips dripping with the words of interposition and nullification. One day right there in Alabama, little black boys and black girls will be able to join hands with little white boys and white girls as sisters and brothers. I have a dream today. You'll note he dreamt of a time when his children would be judged, not by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. And that time's actually come, and people didn't even realize it. It took a huge paradigm shift. It took an invention, one single invention, that equalized the entire world all at once. And no, I'm not talking about a gun, although Sam Colt's sales pitch was God made man and Colt made man equal. No, this did more for more people than Samuel Colt or any gun ever made. And that is the internet. If you think about it, when you get online and you go on to a Facebook group, a chat, an online board, a web page, you don't have anything to judge the person on. You don't judge them on you don't judge them on the color of their skin. You don't judge them on the type of car they drive or the clothes they wear. You judge them on the content of their character, on what they show online. It's truly been an amazing thing. And this, this was recently brought to my attention because I was chatting with someone on one of my social media accounts and we're going back and forth discussing hunting, actually. And after a couple of days of chatting with this individual, he was a good guy. He's enjoyed hunting. He was asking some good questions, um, more on cooking the meat. And I thought, you know what? I wonder who this guy is. I mean, he's, we've chatted for a couple of days. I got no clue who he is. No clue what he looks like. No clue what he does. I figured in the back of my mind he was just another YouTube creator or outdoorsman who had some questions. So there's all kinds of people out there. Honestly, when you're online, you judge them by how they present themselves and nothing more. So the internet has become that great equalizer that Martin Luther King was looking for. That dream that he had that his children would be judged, not by the color of their skin, but by the strength of their character. So. What do you think? Is the internet that big equalizer? Do you have a story where you were chatting with someone online and turned out to be something completely different than you expected? Uh, go ahead and leave your comments below. I look forward to the discussion and you have a wonderful morning.